What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Get Equipped with Gaming. What's up? So this is the hub for the final area in the game, but before we can open it, there is one little thing that I need to do in here. First off, I have enough notes to get to the end of the game, but we're not going to get there yet. Because there's a thing over here that I gotta do. I gotta hit this. So now that room that we were in um, really early on in the game, we can finally go back to it. And that's exactly what we're gonna do. Thanks to the power of shortcut. The you power of shortcut. You call me short punk. I'm calling you shortstop. Uh, Your position in baseball. Is it a good position in baseball? It's the equivalent to second base, just on the other side. Oh, okay. I, I know I don't know very much about baseball, guys. Well, I, I figured out as much. Yeah, it's like when you're when you're in the infield and you have um like you have first, second, and third base, but when you're um here, I'm gonna just let that run. So when you're like you've got first, second, and third base, but when you're playing infield, second base moves kind of in between um first and second base, and then on the other side you have a position called the shortstop. And they take care of, like, kind of in between second and third base. They need that extra player there for, you know, better coverage. Say if someone has a nice line drive down the, like in between second and third base, someone can cover that. Oh. Baseball 101. Baseball with Jet. Yep. I grew up, I'm not a huge, like, I don't play baseball, but I grew up in a baseball-loving family, so we're, they're all about the old bat and ball and stick. And I'm just like, yeah, sports. Yep, sports. Da, 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 sports. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and get this out of the way. I hate this level. <laughs> I hate this level with a burning passion. Like, it's called Click Clock Wood. It's divided up into four sections, each representing the four seasons. And each season is just as huge as the last, with its own little quirks. So you start off in spring, and you have to find the switch in each section to go to the next season. This level is huge, it's annoying, I don't like it, and there's always a way to lose count of your notes. Like, I have kept very careful um, attention as to what I need by the end of each season. Okay, I'm not going to get up that way. Usually I can get up there, but... Oh well, it can wait. So, this is spring. Nice and green and rainy. And you got frickin' Robin Hood. And those guys. They act akin to the... Um, the slug things in uh, Cranker's Cavern and Mad Monster Mansion. I guess Rusty Bucket Bay as well? The, the, the ones that go, Argh! Yeah, those. I like those. They're cool. Yep. And silly. They are cool and silly. Much like me. <laughs> oh, also, there's Mumbo in the solo, but you can only use him in the springtime. So, yeah. Okay, that guy got me. Also, these guys have a slightly different attack pattern. Ah, there's notes. So as I was saying, I have to keep a very close tally as to how many notes I have at the end of each section of the level. So by the end of spring, I need to have 20 notes. Also, cow. Yep. Whoa, okay. Okay, I'll just go up here. Like, there's the most notes in fall, which is kind of, it kind of is misleading. I was like, I've gone through this level. Okay, now I have all the notes in this section. Now I have other things I need to do in this. But, um, uh, I forgot what I was going to say. Something about this section. Um, I don't even remember. Shit, neither do I. That's okay. 
But yeah, this level's long and it sucks, and I hope you enjoy my pain and suffering. I just enjoy you. <laughs> so what do you have over here? Extra life. Um, yeah, we have an extra life. Oh yeah, I don't need any more mumbo tokens. There's nothing over here of value to me. Great. I can't say I know every tactic in this game like I did, like, say, Metroid Prime or Sonic Adventure 2, but... Alright, there's this giant beehive here. We'll be going in here later. Honestly, I should probably go ahead and get some of the mumbo things out of the way. Bees. Yep. Also, like, the mumbo transformation? Yes, like, you can only use the mumbo transformation in spring. Like, if you go into any of the other seasons, your mumbo magic will get weak, and you will transform back into Banjo. Okay, that was close. That, okay, camera. Well, the one thing that I do like about this level is that um, the seasons, as they change, different things will take into effect. Like, this bridge will be complete. Like, in summer, the bad guys will be, like, wearing sunglasses and no shirt. And just little things like that. I want to wear sunglasses and no shirt. It's too cold here. I know, but that sounds awesome. I know, it does. Squirrel! Yeah, this is Nab Nut. We're gonna nab his nuts. Why? No, we're not. Um, oh yeah, this guy's a hidden honeycomb piece in the winter. So yeah, we're, gonna, we're also gonna get the uh, last two honeycomb pieces here. Which are completely optional. Much as they were since Mad Monster Mansion, but you know what? We're gonna get them anyways. Here's gonna be another, um... Annoying. Oh my god, this camera is killing me today. <laughs> camera, no. Camera, stop. Yeah. Banjo Kazooie, great game. Sometimes can be a bit of a pain in the ass. Oh my god, it's like a platypus duck. Yep. It's Aerie, the mighty eagle. And he snores like a fucking pig. Me too. You don't snore. That is true. <laughs> I've been, I've been told I snore sometimes. But pretty much what he did is basically what I do. He woke up and he went right and back to sleep. Right back to bed. <laughs> Alright. And also the gingos are dispersed through the different seasons. Great. Yeah, really. What is in here? Oh yeah, just a jiggy. And there's an extra life, but fuck it. I keep expecting those vines to, like, while you're just standing there, just go whoosh, and, like, smack you in the ass or something. <laughs> well, that's certainly be interesting. Now, there's something I need to do with... Okay, not gonna, not gonna dive off into oblivion yet. Oh, yeah, there's something I need to do here. I think I need to poop eggs in that hole. <laughs> what? I, I don't know. So... Just like, I think I need to poop eggs. <laughs> yeah, just the way you said that. Yep. Did that... Did that just come out of my ass? I'm pretty sure that's not how gardening works. I pulled a plant out of my ass. Me too? Question mark? <laughs> Alright, now I'm gonna go see Mumbo. Pretty sure the only time that plants come out of my ass is when I eat a salad. Well, have you ever... Okay, this, this is gonna be a really disgusting topic. <laughs> Have you ever had corn poopies? Uh, depends. Are you talking about, like, eat a bunch of corn and then... You see, like, a little corn in your poop? No, that has never happened to me before. Really? Nope. Oh, well, okay. Come on, Banjo. Mostly because I don't eat enough corn for that to ever happen. <laughs> well, congratulations. You are one of the lucky ones. Uh, I thought there was something in here. Alright, time for the last mumbo transformation. And we use up all those mumbo tokens we spent all that time collecting. And I turn into a bumblebee! Oh my god, you're so tubby! <laughs> yes. And I can fly! So you press the A button and you fly. And, uh, it kind of works the same way as, like, a flying pad. Except, and you can hold the X button to give yourself a little boost of speed. Hello, fat little bee. 
So I need to collect... I thought I was in here. Oh yeah, it is. I need to collect this Jinjo. If I, I can to, land... <laughs> I, need, I need to collect the there. <laughs> so these Zubas treat you nice as a bee, but when you become... When you return back to Banjo, I think in um, either... I Also, there's a room at the very top of here that I need to go to. If I can just remember where it is. You're so cute and tubby. <laughs> Very much akin to the bee. There we go. Alright, I think I'm done with the bumble. I think I'm done with, uh... Um, spring for now. And I hit the summer switch. Honestly, the most annoying season has to be fall. Why is that? Because you have the most notes and everything's orange and all the leaves are, like, really high. So, like, you Hey, can... me too. No, I'm kidding. Hey. <laughs> you lay off that dank kush. And also take your insulin. Thanks. I try. <laughs> yeah, this is what I was talking about. Like, you go into another season and Mumbo transforms you back into... Back into a, a, ba a bear and a bird. A, 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 a bear? Yes. A small baby bird. <laughs> Eerie hungry now! Right, also, once you wake up Eerie, um, you have to give him caterpillars. <laughs> Banjo's head just eh. <laughs> <laughs> hey! What's going on? <laughs> Whoa! What? What's going on? <laughs> Big hungry animals like caterpillars. But I don't know, i not. I don't like caterpillars. You're also not an animal. Are you sure about that? Because sometimes I can be hungry like a wolf. God damn it. I smell like a sound. I'm lost and I'm found. And I'm hungry like the wolf. I don't understand that song. I don't understand the end where it sounds like... It's supposed to be like a woman moaning, but it just ends up sounding like... Like... Uh... Like a duck. <laughs> eh. It, it gets really annoying and it bugs me. The 80s were a weird time, my dear. That's the only time I don't... That, that, like, I like everything else about that song. But I hate that ending bit. <laughs> Shit. Fly to the bumblebee. They're after me. Also, I think the fall switch is down there. Yeah. Might as well go and nab that while I'm here. All right. I'll get to you later. I kiss you. You did, you kissed me. Oh brother Rome! I was so happy. We watched Italia together. Yeah. Woo! Hey! Woo! Woo! Okay, those voices don't match at all. I've seen people get up there. Like, you're supposed to, once you break the rock, you're supposed to come back in the, um, in winter? Because you have to swim under the water and, uh, get his prize. Mm. But, um, yeah, I've seen people go through there. But no, like, his voice does not match at all. No. Was there a caterpillar over here? No. There was a me over there. Really? Yes. But Smash Bros. hasn't even come out yet. <laughs> and I don't have Street Pass enabled for this title. Oh dear. And somewhere around here is a Grunty Switch. I think I can... I think I need to get it in winter. But, yeah. I assure you, I have 100% of this game before. I believe you. But you've seen me do it. Yeah. I've also witnessed it in the <laughs> flesh. Okay, there's just a Mumbo token over there. My mom is texting me. Hi, Mom. Hi, Mom. If you're watching this, which I assure you you're not, I love you. Don't watch our show, it's pretty crude. <laughs> Alright, another hungry caterpillar, I need that. Hungry, hungry caterpillar. <laughs> On Wednesday, he ate Banjo. Oh, oh. On Tuesday, he ate Kazooie. 
Are you going back in time? <laughs> on Wednesday, he- what? What? You're going back in time. Did I say Monday then- You said Wednesday and then Tuesday. No, I said Monday then- uh, whatever. He said Wednesday and then Tuesday. Well, anyways, minigame! So, pretty much we have to kill all those zubbas here. Pretty simple. Just kill the zubbas. Exterminate the race. Okay. Oh, okay. There we are. Zard, he's beaten us. I killed you. I love that. Oh well, we were getting bored of guarding it anyway. <laughs> we didn't want it anyway. Yeah. That's like how all bullies are. Like when you finally confront them about something, it's like, fine, I do want it anyway. Okay, come on. Up. Oh, there you go. Up, Banjo. Up. But, um... Yeah, don't watch our show. It's pretty launchy. Uh, yeah, like, Naughty, back there, he had, like, two different voices, because, like, his little animation was going, like, woohoo, 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 and his voice in the game was, like, <laughs> like, fucking overbearing King Zora. That's <laughs> what he sounded like. Yeah, yeah, well, you're not wrong. Yar, there be a G. You're a jiggy. I don't like that bit of platforming right there. Because I know if I fall, I'm falling down hard. Well, uh, Banjo's a pretty heavy bear. I'm pretty sure he'd fall pretty fast. Well, you know what they say. The bigger they are, the harder they fall. Yeah. And Banjo would just go, Yeah, see? Just like that. And I still hurt myself. And where am I? Oh, okay. Banjo Bear, where did you go? I like how those bees are flat. <laughs> well, this is an N64 game. Like, you don't even want to look at the fucking, like, trees in Super Mario 64. Because they're just, like, flat and ugly, and you can climb up them, and it's really weird. Or, like, the bushes in, um, Ocarina of, like, the original Ocarina of Time. Mm -hmm. Because, like, they're just, like, Two text well, they're two textures, like two flat images of whatever bush that they're making, yeah. and they're um done like they're placed together in a T fashion. <laughs> so like it looks like the bush no matter what way you're looking at it, but like still it looks really gross and really ugly. Okay, I made it across the bridge. It's done. And now, grass bends to your sword swing. Yeah, not grass bends in any way it wants to and doesn't want to fucking... It doesn't even... Shit, no. Touch my honey this time and you'll be sorry. Yeah, well, we already got introduced to the evil beehives. Also, I'm collecting extra caterpillars because in, like, fall, he needs ten, I think? I'm gonna come in here and see what- Hi, he's fat, he ate too many nuts. And he pooted. There's a little poot. Me too, squirrel. <laughs> yeah, see? Little changes. Yeah, okay. We're gonna go see Mr. Eerie. We have to sit through all the caterpillars. And suddenly, by the power of rareware... That happens. He just fucking grows. Me too! And falls right back asleep. I like how he's wearing like a little diaper. It's cute. Yeah. Basically that bird is me, except for the diaper. <laughs> yeah, you don't wear a diaper. <laughs> Not that anyone knows about. <laughs> I guess you could say it all depends on the situation. Oh, for fuck's sake! <laughs> oh. I hope you like that joke, people! 
I can be funny sometimes. Like, some, sometimes. You're funny all the time. Damn it, I missed the mark. That's okay, I'll just go back around. Okay, why is the camera, like, really close? There we go. I need to get over to where the giant plant was. Oh, how many notes do I have? 36. I wasn't even keeping track. Um, okay. You need... 36. Oh, okay. I've made my mark for this section. Like I said, fall is the most annoying section. Or autumn, or whatever you guys prefer to call it. Do, 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 do. Have you seen a post that's like, English people call it autumn because of all this, like, background kind of words, like French words or whatever? For, right. And then uh, it says Americans. We call it fall because leaf fall down. Oh yeah, I have seen that post. <laughs> also, Gobi. He came here. Hi, Gobi. Oh, fucking asshole. Uh, too bad there's not a bottle of the mold to help me now. Oh, my god, it's gone. Bottles, no! <laughs> Eloi, Eloi. Something sabachthani. What? Roughly translates in Hebrew to, Father, why have you forsaken me? Oh. That's a passage from the Passion, from the Passion of the Christ. Yeah. Yay! I, yeah. Bible, Bible knowledge. But, Bible. Yes, El Bible. Hmm? The Michael, the Michael Bible. Michael Bublé. Yeah. Michael Bubbly. Fuck you, Fall. Punch. Better get here any more caterpillars. Need ten this time. You fat, greedy fuck. Ah, oh, well, I will find your caterpillars. Uh, and you. Uh, what? Is all his color. Yeah, too bad Fall doesn't look like this in, um, in Flagstaff. I mean, it gets close. Kind of. But, yeah, kind of. Alright. So I. Fuck! You, you do? Wow. Hey, you should know. <laughs> well then, you know. <laughs> there we go. Give me the help. I need it. Banjo's a sad bear and he just needs his fix. Okay. Me too, Banjo. Good thing I have all these feathers. Good thing I have all these good looks. You really do. Die, bird. You can't have this caterpillar. I'm going to feed it to another bird. A more important bird. Yeah, I'm going to feed it to a bird that's actually going to give me something. Ow. My bramble field makes you yelp. And... I for... And caterpillar. Yeah. Well, but busy. Sweet many leaves. No magic today. Yeah. Like, if you go in here in the different seasons, Mumbo's doing a different thing. Again, uh, where's his exit? Here it is. So his, his, uh, his, uh, skull is made of skulls. Like, if you go in the door, it's, like, completely made of skulls. Oh. Yeah. That's, uh, not creepy at all. Yeah. Mumbo the, ma Mumbo the, jum the Jumbo. Mumbo the rumble my jumblies. <laughs> and there's the orange Jinjo. Yeah. Oh, also, the Jinjos are color-coded to the seasons. I was just... I just realized that, like, before you said it. Yep. Alright. So this is the last time we see Gobi in this game. Now that's what I call an erection. That's a really cool looking flower. <laughs> right, that's it. I'm off to the lava world. You'll never find me there. Uh, fun fact, in the next game we actually encounter him again, in the lava world. <laughs> also, um, the birds get significantly, um, bigger and smaller, depending on the season. Like, they're the smallest in spring, but they're freaking huge here. Hmm. Okay. Anything worth noting over here? A caterpillar, I 
dancing. You need a pre-order. Yeah, we have to come back through here in the winter because the water's, like, yeah, we broke the rock for Naughty, but the water's not high enough. So, that's why we have to come in the winter. I like the music. It's alright. Oh, okay, I got the note. That's all I cared about. <laughs> I mean, I guess this makes sense that the last level is going to be the hardest one. Because after this, really, all we have is to get the last, uh... Oh, God. See what I was saying about the camera? Yeah. Fuck this. I already traveled up those leaves. And what do we have over here for me? We have a caterpillar. Shall cater to my heavy whim. Eventually, like, I'm gonna need to get onto there once I complete the rest of this bullshit. But yeah, after this, there's very little to the end game. Just got one little final, like, game thing for, um... Oh, is there anything in the hive after I go back in here? After you killed everyone? Oh yeah, there's a couple of notes. Nothing in here for you now, Bear. We've all moved out. But why are you still here? Yeah, why are you here? Is it like fucking Spore where like everyone moves out and they're like, Oh, shit. We're just leaving you behind. You have to go and find your new home. That was annoying with Spore, but I guess it um, offered, you know, exploration. Mm. And the health is still there. And do I have enough caterpillars? I don't know. I thought you had ten. Okay. Well, either way, I'm probably gonna find some on the way up here. Also, Banjo has, like, weird Donkey Kong Country physics, where, like... I think there's notes on the top of here. Oh, no, there's notes on top of here in the, uh, winter. Nothing in here besides the beehive. Besides bees! <laughs> but yeah, Banjo has, like, these weird... Oh, my God! Okay, I land in the water, that's fine. Yeah, see, sometimes I just hate the camera in this game. This game is pretty damn good. But the camera is not. It's a fucking mess. And this playthrough has decided to not be my friend. It's okay. We still love you. Oh, thank you. Did I kill you? Yes. Did I kill you? Yes. I mean, I, I always I'm love kill you, so. you, Well, thank you. And I love you, too. Because we are boyfriend and girlfriend, and that is the thing that we do. Yeah. So, it's gonna be October real soon. Yeah. You got any cool Halloween plans? Oh, I, that was not the direction I thought you were gonna go with that. Oh, well, there's that, too. But, um... <laughs> um, I don't know. Halloween plans. Yeah, neither do I. I'm probably going to be working on Halloween. Same. Yeah, fuck you. Fuck you, Dragonfly. Probably on Halloween, I'll be playing video games. <laughs> probably. I need six more acorns before winter comes. Yeah, so, um, he ate too many nuts, so now he's paying the consequences, and we have to go find, his, find some nuts for him. We have to find six. By breaking windows. Yep, by breaking windows. There's one way to get what you want. Why does that acorn bounce? I don't know. It's alive. This guy's a moiter. Yeah, you can go ahead and have that one. Mmm, Nabnut hasn't got enough acorns yet. You greedy fuck! What did I just get for you? Okay, that makes two. This, uh, very precarious jump makes... Well, I mean, technically I have four. You just need one more. Yep. 
For some reason, this incomplete pathway has a one, and now I just need one more. No. Oh, yeah, yeah. six. Sorry. Yeah, and I, uh, think... Hmm, Namnod hasn't got enough egg on. Yeah, I think there's actually one in his house. Yeah, really. Oh, there's some notes. Oh, yeah. What do you mean you haven't got enough acorns? There's one in your fucking house, you lazy piece of shit. <laughs> You're not very nice, this squirrel. This squirrel deserves it. At least he gave me a jiggy. I'll see you in spring, where once again you'll become a fucking fat ass. <laughs> so... Be nice. <laughs> so I'm um, with video game characters, like with this level in particular, since the seasons revolve, do you think it resets? Or do you think like every time you go around the seasons, like a year advances? I, what, what do you think? I don't know. Depends if you come back and the bird is like an egg again. Okay, okay. get back here. I have a lot of extra caterpillars. Eat! Eat and be happy! Also, apparently, like, with these meager... these meager rations, like, he can manage to... he can manage to, you know, sustain a three-month-long sleep. I mean, whatever makes you happy. Yeah, I mean, look how big he is! That bird is terrifyingly huge. Here we soon be big bird. Must have sleep first. Same. And he is out like a light. Same. <laughs> this bird. He's like my only son. <laughs> I like, thought Cerberus was your only son. Cerberus is my only son. Cerberus is a stuffed whale shark that we are, have. Aren't I your son? You are my son. Oh yeah, I can jump off the beehive. Yay. Ugh. Cerberus just gave me a kiss. Yeah. I'll post a picture of Cerberus so that all of you can see his glory. I think that makes seven or eight jiggies. Seven jiggies, okay. I'm trying to think, what else do I need left? Um, oh, there's notes over there that I missed. I also need to make sure I have every note that I, that I need in this level. Okay. I am missing two notes. Damn. What a shocker. Because I need to have 84 notes by the end of this section. Because I really, really do not want to come back here. Was there any up here? Oh, I guess I can come back up here. I've been waiting months to give you this. Well, thank you for giving it to me now. There we are. 84 notes. Okay. I got the tough part out of the way. Oh, yeah, I remember what's in here in the winter. I come back here and I get a, um, honeycomb piece, I think. Also, the music stays the same. Okay, that's cool. All right, now on to the last section. Also, this part's been going on really long. Yeah, no kidding. Yeah. But it's also kind of a long level, so... Yeah, it is a long level. I mean, the finale is honestly probably going to be shorter than this. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. Like, it'll be barely shorter. Yeah, anyways, last section in the game. The plants are dead, the enemies are all bundled up, and they've got, like, scarves and shit. And these snowball assholes are back. And guess what we're going to have to do with them? Kill them. Yes, we're going to have to kill them. Oh, I heard a Jinjo. Yep. Mumbo's on vacation, you hairy fool. Where are the Jinjo? Oh, yeah, I think it's on top of the hut. Yep. Okay, come on. There we go. Jinjo! Bear, when Gamer picked to spruce up Gamer Profile. Yeah, you nice. get, yeah, you get that gamer pick once you um collect every Jinjo. 
I like yeah. how at the end it's just like, nice. Yeah. So once again, we can attack these guys, but I don't think they give you... Well, I think the Grunty Switch is under one of them. Otherwise, there's just goodies and stuff. I mean, this level's pretty... Pretty chill. This level pretty sucks. I'm actually going to land here. Because I want to get this grunty switch. Wee! And I'm going to appear right on the grunty switch. For some odd reason. Alright, I don't think there's actually anything inside these guys. So, I'm going to go up the mountain. And collect what there is left in this level, which is... One... Yeah, that would be... Uh, one, uh, one jiggy, six, uh, 14 notes, and two honeycomb pieces. Which, uh, both happen to be in the winter. Also, if you hear that, that's the sound of my uh, child that I've been raising. Wait, what? Oh, the screeching, okay. Yeah, he, the, the eagle. Okay, it's... <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, Cerberus like, screech. Yeah. <laughs> Cerberus is a whale shark that sounds like a bird. <laughs> Honestly, if that were the case, I'd probably take him to a doctor. See if there's something wrong. You, you just walk into a pediatric doctor, like, my son needs medical attention. They're like, what's wrong? And they're, he sounds like, like a bird. And they're like, what? And you just pull out a stuffed whale shark. <laughs> You'd be like, are you, are you kidding? Like, no, yeah, this no, is my son. Yeah, no, he really does sound like a bird. Listen. <laughs> oh. Oh, oh. What happened? I think he might be coming unstitched a little bit. What What are you talking about? Like, his, one of his fins is kind of... Oh, the right, the one on the right? Yeah. Yeah, that's been coming, that's been, like, kind of loose. I mean, we can stitch it back up. I can fix it. Oh yeah, there is nothing left in here for me. Oh, my butt's itchy. Yeah. The first time I saw this level, I'm like, what? what is this? Like, what's this weird-ass winter bullshit? I was like, I thought this, like, was a part of Freeze Easy Peak. But, I also, when you're really close to these guys, they don't hurt you. You can bounce off of them, just like fucking normal. But they don't actually hurt you. Also, this is a stop and swap area. You come in here and you get the last um, stop and swap egg. I went in there because I- oh wait, I know what I need to do while I'm here. There's actually another room I need to go into. We, And that's this thing up here. Now I just need to find a way to land in there. There we go. There is a... There is a... It's somewhere around here. Where? There's, a, there's supposed to be a honeycomb piece up here. Oh yeah, there it is. Also, any rooms inside the trees uh, remain the same through all the seasons. That makes sense. They're inside the tree. Yeah. Granted, you might have, like, an extra ring, but... That's actually bullshit. Bird. Bird. Yep. Look at... Eerie, mighty eagle at last! Watch as I fly into the sky! I actually like this part. You'll see why. Look, he's big and fat, he has these tiny ass wings. And he poops out he a jiggy. He just fucking shat out a jiggy. Love it. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> I love it. Do it again. <laughs> <laughs> I guess those caterpillars had like some kind of alchemic powers. I guess. They turn into gold. 
Or the ca caterpillars were just made out of gold from the get-go. Uh, there we go. Alright. All right. Finally did that. Now I'm gonna jump and like lose all my health. Because there's one final thing I need to do in this level. And then it all is going in this icy water. Yes, that's right. Swim under there. Icy water takes double air. Yes, I know. It does take double air. It's the same thing as like swimming in the water in Rusty Bucket Bay, but I need it because I need to go in here. Also, you probably noticed Kazooie's uh, wings actually froze while she was in there. I didn't see that. Yep. So now we have all the honeycomb pieces in the game. Getting those last six honeycomb pieces doesn't do shit for you. But, but hey. It's nice. Yeah, it's nice. You know, 100%. I say as I completely skip like half of the mumbo tokens. Or like a quarter of them. Alright. So that pretty much does it for, um... That pretty much does it for this. There's only one last thing we need to do, and I need to go back this way. And that's how a party. Nope. Oh, okay. I need to go back to spring and turn into the bee. But can we have a party anyway? Yes, we can have a party anyway. Nice. Well, that's one thing we're actually going to get to do in the game, is have a party. Really? Yeah. Awesome. You know what we should do? What? We should have a, a party at our apartment. An apartment? An apartment. That'd be cool. I like that. Invite all of our close friends. Oh yeah, by the time this video comes out, you guys will have already seen the, um, the Mario Kart, Mario Kart playthrough. So, you can see who some of our friends are. Or, yeah, I guess two of our friends, but... Yeah. No, that's all we need. We only have two friends. <laughs> uh, oh, I just cracked my back and that felt glorious. I'm glad. Jesus, Mary Joseph. This level's so long. I could have taken a second nap. Yeah, okay, take a second nap, you know, during the fucking... No, no, no. Boots, stop. Yeah, go ahead and take a fucking second nap during our playthrough. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just surprised I didn't fuck up as badly. Usually I screw that level over pretty hard, and that's what, like, really eats at my time. Mm. So, now that we're the Bumblebee, we need to go and get the last... The very last Jiggy in the game. Jiggy Jiggy. No. I'm flying down! I'm going! Oh. Nice me to fucking land on this platform. Flawless. Ten out of ten. Yeah, I need the bumblebee. Because you gotta get all the way up here. There we go. Now we have every Jiggy in the yeah, game! Look at him! Look at his little arms! And we're like... <laughs> yeah. Alright. So before things get too crazy, we're gonna cut the episode off here. Yeah. In the next part, we're gonna have the final bit. So take care of you pretty people. Bye, guys.